The high knee pull is a dynamic stretching exercise for the lower body, which focuses on reducing the risk of injury, optimizing power production capabilities, and improving flexibility. It targets the glutes, hip flexors, and hip adductors. Take a step and raise the left knee towards the chest. Grab your leg with both hands just below the knee. Pull knee as close to your chest as possible and hold the knee for one second. Release the left knee again, take a step and raise the right knee and repeat. The buttocks kicks is a dynamic stretching exercise which focuses on reducing the risk of injury, optimizing power production capabilities and improving flexibility. Now kick yourself in the buttocks with the heels of your feet. It targets the quadriceps. The straight leg kick is a dynamic stretching exercise which focuses on reducing the risk of injury, optimizing power production capabilities and improving flexibility. Keep leg straight and raise it as far in front of you as possible. The opposite hand touches the toes of the raised leg. Release the leg back to the ground and repeat. It targets the hamstrings. The bilateral lunge is a dynamic stretching exercise which focuses on reducing the risk of injury, optimizing power production capabilities and improving flexibility. Take a step sideways and bend the knee until the left knee is at 90 degrees and the right leg is straight. Keep the weight on the heels. Now push off with the foot again, return to athletic stance and perform a lateral lunge to the other side. It targets the hip AB ductors the hip adductors and the glutes. The lunge and twist is a dynamic stretching exercise which focuses on reducing the risk of injury, optimizing power production capabilities and improving flexibility. Take a large step out with the leading leg, drop trailing knee towards the ground in a controlled fashion until both knees are at 90 degrees, rotate the torso all the way from right to left, keep weight on the forward heel, Stand up and progress into the next lunge. It targets the glutes, quadriceps, hamstrings, hip flexors and obliques. The supine knee to chest is a static stretching exercise which focuses on improving flexibility, reducing risk of injury and aids in the muscle recovery process. It targets the glutes. Place floor mat on the ground, lay down in supine position meaning face up and keep legs close together with toes pointing straight upward. Flex one hip to 90 degrees, hold leg with both hands below the knee and pull it towards the chest. Maintain neutral pelvic and spine position, hold stretch for 45 seconds. Plant towel hamstring is a static stretching exercise which focuses on improving flexibility, reducing the risk of injury and aids in the muscle recovery process. It targets the hamstrings and calves. Place floor mat on the ground. Lay down flat in supine position with legs close together and toes pointing straight up. Flex the hip and lift one leg off the ground. Maintain head ground contact. Hold towel in both hands and wrap it around the toes. Keep knee extended and slowly pull leg into 90 degrees of hip flexion or as far as possible. Maintain hip ground tag for the non-stretched leg. Well, that's it again for today's episode. As usual opinions differ. What's your point of view? Let us know below in the comment section. A brand new episode will be available next Sunday. So make sure you don't miss it and subscribe. In the meantime, I recommend you watch some of the previous episodes. You should really watch them all. If you like what you saw, tell your friends. I'm sure they will appreciate it. I'm Philipp Halfmann. Thank you for watching and Auf Wiedersehen. Tennis Conditioning TV episodes are licensed under Creative Commons. You are welcome to link or embed these videos, forward them to others and share these ideas with people you know. Brought to you by Advanced Concepts of Strength and Conditioning for Tennis. Available at TennisConditioningBook.com Music by Dan O at DanOSongs.com